Happy Friday, everybody. Welcome, welcome. Happy uh, Tory downfall day to all those who celebrate. Isn't it a beautiful day? The sun is shining. The world is a brighter place. Isn't it so glorious? <gasps> Hello, everybody. How's everybody doing? Oh, yeah. I hope all the audio James and everything Jenkins. is fixed. Good. It's the flipping <clears throat> weekend. How are you? How was your day? Please. It's Friday, my dudes. Hope you and the Walrus Clan are having an awesome day. We are. We and the Walrus Clan, including Emma, who is totally normal and not cursed at all. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, we're having a lovely day. We're having a very, very lovely day. I hope you all are doing very well. Uh, and of course, thank you for the bit, Stephen. Um, oof. Adip. It's coming through. It's coming through. Hey, thank you very much, Adip. Seven. So thank you very much for the subscription for 56 months. Good Lord, man. Oh, you're an absolute hero, a legend and a scholar. Thank you very much. Um, and hello, Jimothy James Jenkarino Jenkins. I see someone's read my birth certificate. Coolie Wooly, give that back. Seriously, I need that. I need that as some sort of, well, it's not a photo ID, is it? Um, no, we, we, uh, we, we did some voting in the UK, um, many parts of the UK, maybe not actually Scotland or anywhere else, but yeah, like, uh, not in the UK at least. Uh, we had some, we had some, uh, some by-elections, so, uh, all boring loan while have a new MP, he's the most charismatic of the men, except for all the others, but he's not a Tory, so that's fine, <laughs> fantastic. Just England and Wales, yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, I wasn't too sure about Scotland, actually, but, um, yeah. Ah, that's that's good to know. Um, and yeah, turns out uh, who to funk it? The toys are not very popular right now. So um, good. Finally, finally, people are coming to their senses, and let's hope that continues. You okay? You okay there, Emma? Yeah, you're all right. Um, Hopefully people come to their senses uh, a little bit more when it comes to the general elections. I did see that trial and badger. It was so flipping fantastic. It was amazing. Uh, so for anyone who's not aware, um, Boris Johnson, former prime minister who passed uh, a law that required people to have a photo ID in order to vote, which was very heavily skewed towards older people and not the younger generation who are 
typically anti-Tory sentiments. Um, well, he passed his law and uh, guess what? He forgot to bring his photo ID when he came to vote yesterday, which is just the best, isn't it? Just the best. It's been a, it's been a fun past 24 hours, let's, let's put it that way. I'd vote for Emma, especially with the war's mask. <laughs> Good stuff, Gully Wally. Um, I, I don't know what you're talking about. That's just Emma. That's just Emma. It's just nothing, nothing weird or cursed. That's just how it be. That's just regular Emma. Oh, no, where's the mouse? Where's the mouse? Oh, find ya. There we go. Um, is Count Binface finally doing something? I'm not sure. I, um, he's specifically London, isn't he? So I don't, like, I see him pop up now and again, but it's like, they might not be London, but yeah, uh, he, it's, he's not, apart from being a meme, he's not relevant enough to, like, my local specific area, so I don't know. I should know more about it, to be fair. But he's, he's very good, and I would vote for a count in face, quite frankly. Um, not sure they come to their senses. Near 17% of people here vote for reform. Well, yeah, that's a good point. The spiritual successes to UKIP and the BNP. Yeah, it's terrifying, isn't it? I've, I've seen that, and it's like, so for some people, the, the Tories weren't right-wing enough, which is terrifying, really, but there you go. Um, I'd vote for James as he brings me the weekend each week. Exactly. Vote for real and meaningful change, and I control the weekends now. <laughs> so uh, yeah, you can't you can't complain about that, right? Um, that would be that would be my number one thing. Weekends and one dollar for everyone. I mean, it might cost a bit. What's the population in the UK? Uh, maybe I'll get back to you on the dollar thing. But weekends, weekends are going to be a thing. Don't worry. Uh, long weekend this one as well. If again you celebrate the UK bank holidays. Um, right, well, as you might have noticed from the uh, from the title of the stream, or potentially on Twitter or wherever, uh, seven day weekend, a vote for James is a vote for no what I'd, uh, yeah, I'd fully back that. Maybe a one day week, one one day working week. Let's not be silly here. I mean, we gotta get some work done, you know what I mean? But uh, at the same time, if all you get is a dollar, I did more than one day a week, you know what I mean? Um, right, anyway, <laughs> on, on to the game stuff I should, um, I should mention before we go any further, uh, because we're not playing Cyberpunk today, we're playing a, a lovely game that came out a couple of months ago called Pacific Drive, or Specific Drive, if you want to get specific about this. Um, yeah, it's a cool little, I don't know whether it's technically an indie game, it's like a double A game, potentially. Uh, but I want to uh, thank the devs, uh, uh, Ironwood Studios, and uh, Publisher as well, thank you to Kepler Interactive as well for gifting us that code because guess what? Oh, it's a hashtag ad, oh, hashtag, etc, etc. Um, yeah, of course, and that means as per ASA guidelines, we are uh, required to disclose this as a hashtag ads, hashtag sponsored stream, etc, etc. Even though no cash money has been exchanged, they've only just provided the code. Hashtag blessed. Yeah, it's, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Uh, we are very lucky folks, uh, although in this case it's, you know, uh, not exactly a release day code, but I've been keeping my eye on this game. This is something that I wanted to like get around to anyway. Um, hashtag sell out, hashtag shill. Exactly, exactly. It's all the good stuff. Um, one of these days, uh, I'm going to be, you know, I'm going to motivate myself to sort out a, uh, you know, a big obnoxious like hashtag ad thing uh, pop up on the screen. That'll be funny, right? Um, code is a code. A code's a code's a code. Um, but yeah, it's it's one of those things where, uh, yeah, have my eye on it for a while. It's pretty cool. It's, it's uh, very interesting vibes. I've only played like a couple of... Uh, Maybe two to three hours last night more we'll start again we'll go from the beginning and some of that will be tutorials but essentially it's like a a weird sort of survival elements to it uh but it's like a bit of a survivally game in your own car and you upgrade the car and there's weird stuff going on um and yeah we'll, we'll find out more soon enough we'll find out more um, a smart man always sides with money. Congrats on being a hashtag sellout, James. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, feels good. Feels good to be smart. S M R T. S M R T. I mean S M A R T. Uh, yes. Very smart indeed. Right. Shall we? Shall we crack on? Unless we want to. You know. Do you want to do another ten minutes of like, you know, uh, political chat? From my, you know, <laughs> potentially less than perfectly informed brain 
It's, uh, it's actually just an English bank holiday, but I work for an England-based company, so I get it anyway. Well, that's fantastic news, we carry it. Congrats, congrats. Ban holiday usually means no TP Mondays. Oh, that's true. That is true. Um, even though I still stream, no? You don't know. And if not, well, look, come on. It's his, it's his day off. He's earned a day off. It's fine. It's fine. Um, what happened? <laughs> I've lost. Oh, no, I've lost Lord Brockbridge's vote. Was that because of a one day working week? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Lord Brockbridge. We can come to a compromise. Don't worry. Um, money can be used to buy biscuits and goods and services, of which biscuits are included in those two things. Uh, but you're allowed a bloody day off. Oh, boy, oh, mate. <laughs> um, yes, this is true. This is true. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm very excited to, to crack on this game. It's very, very cool. Very uh, weird vibes. I mean, actually, no, no, no. Sorry, sorry. The, the official pipeline is that nothing weird. It's totally normal Pacific Northwest. It's just a, it's a regular road trip. No weird, trippy anomalies or anything like that happening. And everybody is exactly the same as they always are and always have been. Isn't that right, Emma? Yes. Regular Emma. Anyway, <laughs> let's crack on. Where's the button? Oh, that's a point. I need to double check that that is... Oh, you know what? I thought I was really well prepared. No, 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 no. Let's not... Let's not get too ahead of ourselves here because I think the... Yeah, okay. I forgot to get the bloody capture for the game, didn't I? You silly bollocks. It's fine. Just a brief, brief uh, switcheroo. I'm gonna be this one, mate. Uh, yeah! <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. Um, significantly less uh, technical difficulties than there were last week, thankfully. So, for anyone tuning in just on the, you know, the, the continuity of technical difficulties. Wow, she's actually kind of in frame here. That's, that's interesting. <laughs> Okay, let's see if we can. <laughs> yeah, man. Let's just get a totally not disturbing normal. Oh my god, Emma. Can't stay awake, can she? No! I say no te technical difficulties, but things are falling down as we speak by the second. So, best crack on, shall we? Um, yeah, uh, I'd like to say thank you to uh, Ironwood Studios and was it Kepler Interactive for providing the code for this. Um, it is certainly a very interesting gam. Is this is, is this gonna work? Hello, hello. Okay, let's maybe. You tried switching it on and off again, off and on again. No, of course it's not worked. Controller, please. Yeah. Okay, now we're in business. Now we in business. Um, biscuits, goods, and services to free. Corners of commerce, yeah. The the almighty pillars of our economy. Um, it's Emma, of course you can't stay awake. I do like the menu. The menu's really cool. Like, everything about this. I mean, look at this for a splash screen. That's, that's beautiful, isn't it? Isn't that so good? You can just about see behind my uh, my silly mug that the uh, car lights are going. Um, I think the game might be a bit loud. Ooh, I did turn it down, but thank you for, for flagging that. We could turn it down a little bit. Cheers, Charlie Badger. You're a star, sir. Um, you, what? What? Did you say something? I can't hear you. Of the sound of peaceful road trip vibes. Um, yeah, lush forest hiking trails and scenic drives. Beautiful, isn't it? Uh, how about now? I mean, that was quite like a loud ambiance. Yeah, it looks looks a looks a little bit better. The blaring sound of serenity. Uh did you say? Did you say something? I could barely hear a thing. It's whisper quiet. Okay, right. In Pacific Drive, the game saves when you load into a new level. You can save during a trip by leaving the current level, triggering a save, manual saves. Well, we'll get to that. So we can actually customize the settings. I think maybe there's some gameplay settings in here that uh, we can change at this point. Maybe, maybe, maybe not. Uh, I don't think it's really necessary to mess around. I've changed the important things, um, including streamer mode. So I swear to God, I swear to God, Twitch, if you if you take us down for this, take us down for speaking too much truth, 
Oh, it's actually a bit too political for my taste. Anyway. You'll have to speak up, I'm wearing a towel. <laughs> in 1947, the Olympic Peninsula became a stage of drought for promising new technology. I believe that's in the Pacific Northwest, they're not good at American geography. As rumours of its utopian creation spread, da -da 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 -da. something weird happened. <clears throat> In 1955, the government walled off a section of the peninsula to establish the Olympic Exclusion Zone. For 30 years, the zone's borders grew until the government withdrew and sealed every access point. Might still be a bit loud. Balls. <laughs> Maybe I'm a bit too quiet. I don't know. I don't know. I've never had that before. Uh, what happened inside was never disclosed. Oh, God. So, yeah. That's the vibe of this. A lot of mystery. A lot of mystery about this one. Kind of kind of weird, kind of freaky. Uh, as soon as we get in proper, we're going to adjust that sound. Don't you worry. Hey, like a glove. James Jenkins. It's been a while. Pacific Drive. Toot toot, rubber flippers. Uh, oh, no. There's a little bit of um, screen tearing there. I know this. Anyway, that's, we can't be having that. That's not on. Okay, how about, yeah, it does look a bit loud still. I'll, um, I'll adjust that. We'll adjust that even further. Because I want to maybe just dip the music. I want the dialogue quite high still. Hmm. Radio music down to 50. Try that. Okay, how about now? Is it still a bit aggressive? Still a bit much? Yeah, I know. Are we gonna have to change, reduce flicker and visuals? Um, vignette, vignet, v-sync, sure, probably. Um, let's stick with 60, shall we? That's always a good ballpark figure. Um, my friends hope clients well. I hope you do well as well, like a glove. Lovely to see you again. We uh, we be we be driving right now. We, I think I think we might be all right there. If I'm just uh, the walrus can. <laughs> the walrus can what? What can it do? So look, we're in we're in first person driving around. It's just like cyberpunk. We've just escaped, you know, Night City and gone back in time to I think 1998. But apart from that, exactly the same. You know, we want to do some crazy hit and runs and stuff. Whack our wipers on. Uh, the music's really cool, actually. Might have heard. We might not be able to hear all of it. This is on stream. Right? Yeah. And then if you if you park up right, is it gonna let us? It won't. Okay. So we're not quite up that far yet. But look at this. It's lovely. Nice chill time. Nice happy day driving through the beautiful Midwest. Wars can do anything, especially the beautiful creature next to you. Whoa, blimey. Yeah, I was distracted by the comment. And, of course, more. <laughs> uh, yes, it's, it's lovely, isn't it? Um, whoa! Toggle wipers. Uh, beep. 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 I don't mind doing that. That's, that's wipers noise, isn't it? Uh, James, can we pull over? I need to go to the toilet. Oh, for goodness sake. All right. James drives like I do. <laughs> With reckless abandon. Are we there? Yeah, guys. Oi. Pack that in back there. Otherwise, there'll be no Disneyland for anybody. All right, cool. One more word. One more word. I swear to God. I've got to pop, got to pop wipers on it. Look, now the weather's gone bad. And I'll blame you guys. Also, the driving's a bit. Ooh, there we go. <laughs> That's it. Back to Winnipeg. <laughs> Man, we've done well. We've, we've thrown in a couple of sets of references already. We've uh, we're not messing around. There's all these bugging me again. Right. That's it. Wipers are off. It's the only control I have at the minute. Um, can we? We can't. Okay. Cool. 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 Kicking the back of my seat. God damn it, Cully Wooly. Stop kicking the back of seats. Well, Bravi, stop bugging people. And I'm pretty sure Trowling Badger's doing something. 
I know, I see you. I see you in the... Oh, we don't even have a rear view mirror. That's weird and dangerous. What is this bloody uh, Arctic lorry? Rot won't keep his hands to himself. Oh, wow, I mean, you know. We've both been being too handsy, as far as I'm concerned. But there's no rules against uh, handsiness in this car. We, we, we totally chill vibes about that. As long as everyone's okay with it, obviously. Hey, I'm just having a read, keep to myself. <laughs> That's true. Oh, no, we crashed. Okay, right. If anybody complains about the driving control, um, the, the driver's abilities to control the car. That's it. Back to Winnipeg, you know? We go, whoa, we're absolutely bombing it. Madness, yeah. <laughs> get away with it. Get away with it. Oh, 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 right, okay. Uh, turns out it's really difficult to pay attention to the car when you lot keep messing around back there and also because I'm looking at the, uh, the street chat. Uh, reading in the car, you are brave. Whoa! I can't read in the car. Yeah, it's difficult actually, it's very easy. I used to be really bad for that as a kid, like I'll read a little bit. Or uh, probably more likely playing uh, Game Boy Advance or something. Squinting at the screen because there's no backlights and stuff. Um, well, that main road's fine, right? but, but yeah, like, doing that, just more bad, bad car sickness. But I think that's going to go on fine. Um, you'd be getting loads of points of force for hitting all this stuff. Yeah, or burnout. It's one of my these strengths. Oh, damn. Yeah, your, your other few strengths include all the other things that you are super strong at. Oh, something's going on here. Guys, um... I mean, carry on reading or not reading, or you know, getting handsy and kicking uh, to your to your heart's content. Turn off the wipers; it's not great. Look, look. If there's anyone backseat driving, all right? Okay. <laughs> Slow down, you trying to kill someone? Well, I'm not trying to kill us, but something else might be because there's weird stuff going on. What the hell is this? Okay. Modding and reading the car. <laughs> Trawling, modding, and reading the car. What skills do you need exactly? Might want to practice trying to calm down before we go through. Well, and that's what happens when you criticise the driver. No backseat driving, okay? Okay? Maybe a little bit. Okay, everybody gets one comment. But you, but you can't use it early. That's it. The end. We completed the game. Good game, everybody. James, I don't need to pee anymore. I'll oh, get. Oh. Um. Good, I guess. <laughs> and the whole plane clapped. Yay, everybody, welcome to Winnip I mean, uh, the Olympic exclusion zone. That looks a bit weird. I'm sure it's fine. The car, I mean, we kind of totaled the car anyway, so, you know, small blessings if, if we're being completely honest. Um, I blame Tori, so that cost me void. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, this is what happens when you don't fill the potholes. Yeah. You know, you get some weird portal to a, what might be another dimension. It might be the same dimension. You get, you get weird stuff happening. Look. Look at this. Potholes are so bad. There's debris floating everywhere. Debra is. Huh. This is what I did when I was playing last night as well. I was like, can you, can you, can you do heads and volleys? Come on. They do they do move slightly, so that's pretty cool, huh? Um, right, we've got to find some transportation. Look, the what? I guess I'm going to reach out about getting cars in. Yeah, that's um, quite an important thing for, for a mod. you gotta you got to be reading whilst driving, really. Um, but hey, chat's behaving themselves now. Chat's fine. Yep, every, everybody coming with us? It's a little, it's a little walking road trip. Everyone's favourite part of the road trip, where we pull over to get, you know, sucked into a weird portal and then into the other side of the exclusion zone. The other side of the wall. Yeah, we've all been there. Oh, are you ready? Are you ready for this? You're not going to believe what you can do next. Look at this. Ugh! <laughs> Kick with our invisible legs. Uh, it's a shame that they don't have just a classic like, BAM! That would be amazing. Uh, can we stop the dolls on the way home? Well, oh, yes, if everyone behaves. Someone out there? Hello. Uh, 
Ooh, How's the volume for the dialogue, sure. by the way? Silo gifted the tier one Friends, sub to Boring Loner. Thank you very much, Silo, for gifting the sub there. You're an absolute hero. And Boring Loner, you enjoy that sub. You enjoy it. You were supposed to tune up this piece of junk as long years as ago. you enjoy it in a peaceful manner and don't cause trouble whilst we're on a nice road trip, okay? Um, also, hello. <laughs> hello, Silo, how you doing? <laughs> um, so, we got Tobias. Tobias! Uh, Stephen, thank you very much for gifting the sub as well to Kaka2 Toxic. What, what, what? Uh, we got to put the wheel back on this this car because it's not in a good state right now. I mean, it looks fine apart from that, and you know, missing the headlight, and yeah, there's a door back there that's missing. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, Yes, thank you very much for the gift of sub there, Stephen, as well. Uh, could he really? Yeah, James is a cool one. Mom always says we have McDonald's at home. I mean, look, we can, if everyone behaves, just watch Godzilla minus one. What? So, what? How is it? Is it just a weaker Godzilla? I never understood that. Oh, God. Can we um, tap out? Yes, that's good. Um, oh, we can't use control at the same time. It's a shame. Uh, can we drive through Starbucks? I want a pink drink. We drive through it. We literally drive through it, but you ain't getting anything. But we're, we're going through one that doesn't have a drive through. We're just going to drive straight through it anyway. Because, you know, it's the quickest route to where we're going. Uh, maybe grab something on the way if you're very quick. Um, hello, Baba Fandrew. Let's go in. It's weak Godzilla, but a great movie. Oh, good. I'm glad. Godzilla movies were always a bit iffy. But I, I liked the one that was... Um, even though I think hardcore fans had a problem with it. The, the one from, like, the early 2000s, I think. You know. The, the silly one with all the, the baby Godzillas. But, hey, it was fun. It was all right. It wasn't terrible. Well, pardon me. Um, I don't think it's a good idea. There's always pink fur up afterwards. <laughs> this must have been American fan. I don't believe that there's any pink drinks in UK Starbucks. So, this is something you notice about the game. It's very, like, um, makes a point of having certain things feel very tactile and mechanical. You've got to actively look at the thing, turn on the ignition. There might be control options to change it off, but I just believe. Oh, Hi, Tobias. Sorry, I don't read you, can't, mate. It looks like you're somewhere around Sector E. Hey, Francis, come here. Yes, it's urgent. Leave yeah. that interferometer alone for a second. Something is out Interfere there. Interferometer. He's interfere on with Algo Time. It's not the Simpsons one. Good lord. We, we, we're rolling. We are rolling today. Hey, we got a live one. Hey, hey uh, pissed stop. Ugh, pissed stop. Hello? How you doing? <laughs> you good? Hello? Is this thing working? Oh, uh, it might be a little while. They don't have a transmitter. We won't hear a thing back. Huh. But if they're stranded... Could they mean they're from outside? Oh no. They're a breacher. Good job. No. Hey, hey, how We're did a you breacher. get to the barrier wall? Jack no breacher. one's gotten into the zone in ages and lived to tell about it. And if we don't mm. get them to safety, this one won't either. That's a good point. I'm not going to hey, talk to you, my friend. you're in serious danger. The instability's closing in, and it's going to scramble you quicker than beef in a blender. Beef in a blender? The shelter is a few miles east. Get there however you can, and be quick about it. Tobias's accent is something. Yeah, it's um, yeah, <laughs> it certainly is, isn't it? Why is the driving wheel moving with that invisible hands? We don't even have a body look, we just float. We just, we just be. We just. <gasps> I didn't realize you could honk. Yeah, hell yeah. Uh oh. Mic off. Oh, bloody hell, mate. Oh, it's your fault. Whoever's on the road, learn to drive. Oh, well, yeah, we might want to put it in park. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Blended beef a thing in the state. Yeah, no, who's who's putting beef in a blender? That's a good point. That's a very good point, this stuff. Um honker honker. Um almost as good as Untitled Goose Game. Yeah, almost as many honks. You gotta you gotta love a good good honkin. A good honker honker. Um uh, so I think I missed a couple of, of, of chat things there, but um Oh yeah, that was it. <laughs> Uh, Lord Bravich, oh, I heard the world's seventh biggest rubber band ball is down the next exit. Can we go there? We absolutely can. Are you kidding me? That sounds amazing. Alright. So, luckily enough, 
we've got this attached to something disturbingly sticky in the back there. Um, not really going to ask many questions there, but uh, yeah, no, it's it's cool. There's there's some floating rocks, but otherwise it's still the same vibe as we had before, right? Can you hear the ominous sounds? Why is your car on the wrong way around? I know, it's just some crazy American thing that they're doing. They they build them wrong way around, they drive them wrong way around. I don't understand them, but you know. When in the Olympic exclusion zone, I guess. Uh, Honkai Star Rail. Oh, don't you, don't you start with the old Honkais. I don't want to catch Honkai again. That's a, that's a nightmare scenario. It'll be three weeks to get rid of it last time. The old honkies. <laughs> I'm not sure you can say that on Zoom. <laughs> Just realised what I was saying there. The old honky star rails. Bam. Honky tonky star rail. Uh, yes, that's normal. Let's just get in the car, roll them up, everybody. Does it go forward when you shift it into reverse? Uh, possibly. Turn and drive, turn on, come on, go, 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 go. Oh, that's some weird stuff happening. Everybody in the car, roll up the windows. I don't care if you're missing the door back there. Go, go, go. There it is again, that's lip on the I've seen that waveform before, but where? <gasps> no kidding. No what could be. A remnant? That can't be. There hasn't been one in decades. Device sounds like Look he wants to be... Look at that special fingerprint and tell me that doesn't match the remnants exactly. No, no, no. What, what, what we should be looking at is oh, how wait. fast this preacher seems to be moving. Huh. You know, if I didn't know better, I'd say they're going about the speed of a... No way. No, no way. way. Not tell me. Hey, I'm walking remnant, here. And it's a car this time? They found a remnant? Holy Sorry, Christ. I told you about it. No one's here working wheels in here for ages. Boy, I'm killed to know how a combustion engine's still chugging away out there. Really? Okay, let's not get ahead of chugging. ourselves. First, the breacher needs to get to safety. Then we can look into whether that car is a remnant or not. In my heart of hearts, I already know. They're uh, back, that's, baby. That's normal. That's normal. Just keep powering through. Oh, this is to find the parking space at Walmart. Yeah, yeah. It do be like that. Alfie ain't gonna like you poking around in there, but better to face a bad side than let the zone eat you alive. Yeah, Hoppy. Let's see what looking for, yes. Um, Tobias sounds like Benedict Cumberbatch trying to do a Boston accent, so not good. <laughs> really, really, yeah, I mean, um, I... I see what you mean. Well, I was gonna say, it sounds like he's auditioning for the... Um, for the sequel to the 80s, oh, that was weird. Uh, for the sequel to the 80s Super Mario movie, that we never, we never got a sequel of. Criminally so. Well, excuse me, sir. Excuse me. This is not meant to be happening. I don't think. <laughs> well, that was something, huh? Oh no! I've done the thing where the wipers are like stuck. Um, I don't think that's meant to be happening there, bro. Okay. <laughs> oh, boy. Um, sounds like someone with a European accent of some kind trying to do an American Southern accent. What? No, well, I would never do such a thing. What are you talking about? Hey, Tobias here. It's a feature hashtag ad. <laughs> yeah. Um, do we need to maybe check something on the settings? I don't know, man. I don't know. Um, I feel like it would have, uh, DLSS is off. I don't know if we were able to add in. Well, it would, it would let us, right? Maybe, maybe do that. We didn't put that on, to be fair. Everything else is on ultra, good lord. No bloody wonder. Is it? Turn off glitches in the settings. Nope. <laughs> okay then. I uh yeah, okay, okay. Um hmm. Hmm. Let's see now. Foliage effects. Oopsie. Maybe we just dip the effects a little bit. Dip that, dip that. Dip, 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 and don't feel. Um, I've been watching a lot of Always Sunny recently. I'm going back. 
Good lord. What a, what a show, huh? What a show. Maybe put bugs on Max instead of middle. Ah, oh, it's a classic. Classic mistake. Um, medium, medium, high, high. No shadow quality. The mirror's not a problem. Distant. That's all mirror stuff as well. Uh, okay. Hopefully. We fixed it. We're a genius. An absolute goddamn genius. Okay. And um, things actually feel a bit smoother as well. Ha ha ha! Champion. Right. Flip the breaker. Let's go. Because uh, this is still a little bit of a tutorial, but shortly we'll get into the actual meat of the game. The blended yeah. beef of the game, if you will. Oh, I'm kind of actually picking up this uh, the classic alarm sound. Cast. Love that. Hello, uh, attention. <laughs> hey, uh, Luigi. Luigi. Let's see, put the radio on. on um, official zone business. So, now, we have it on pick this up, <laughs> Oppie, uh, it seems like friend. I think Oppie is friend. It's on the post Idris Elba cyberpunk set to remove the clip. Fix now. Uh, Boom. Uh, right, like uh. Super Right, this is safe. good. Now, if this you do good. not comply, I will occupy this broadcast channel with a recitation of the entire collection of poems I've personally written. That's 10 years and 17 volumes. Stupid <laughs> <laughs> voice goes like a nail gun to the skull. So, <laughs> I like it. Another breacher, huh? As an ignorant How British folk, outsiders not I didn't really clock the, the Tobias accent. Wall out there for I thought it was a bit silly, but Unless nothing too one crazy. Of the who got through. Wait, but yeah, I've, I've liked I the back and forth so far. I don't give a damn why or how you got here. I You're don't trespassing, and I'd kindly like you to get the hell out of my zone. All right. All right, bloody hell, Oppie. Unfortunately, the barrier wall is as okay, fortified against bridges up. trying to get Lovely. in as it is against anyone or anything trying to leave. Oh, and we have to of find you like way out. The thing, yeah? So you might as well start by fixing up that car. Just don't break anything in my shop with those soft hands of yours. Soft hands? How dare you? Just because I keep my hands moisturized? How dare you? Right. Well, we're gonna go get a car, and then uh, let's see. Then let's see. It's round here, wasn't it? And then guess what? The wheel fell off. So uh, uh, also, is it is it too dark? Is it okay? I might up the brightness just a smidge as well. well I know we're messing around. Quit messing around over here. Is there a way to increase brightness? That would be nice. That would be nice. Accessibility. Uh, guy the camera drag. Turn camera delay after some turns and shakes. I would like zero camera delay if we're being honest. To be fair, we just put the wheel back on. Didn't really put any lug nuts on it. Who you call it lug nut? Oi! <laughs> Tim's don't just waltz out in the rain. You catch it. You catch death. Um, maybe we put on brighter nights then. Maybe that will help it. Hmm. Has it saved it? It has saved the thing. Oh, for goodness sake. Oh, yeah, brightness is right there, mate. Brightness is right there. It's literally the first thing you see. You silly bollocks, right? And that's that's not much changed. Soft hands refer to people who don't play souls boring games. Okay, me. Oh. No, well I play them. I've played the souls ball game before. You are oh, talking about dark souls stuff. Okay, no, I'm a fraud. Lol. Okay, we can just fix that back up. It's a nice summer tire. The um, so since we've now got, like I I do love the stylized. UI and stuff that they've done for this game. It's very, very cool. Um, and yeah, you've got uh, this. There is quite a lot though. 
Um, it does look a bit... I, I was overwhelmed just at the very start. It's certainly like... It's a look to get used to, but I do like it. Um, yeah, yeah, that's what I was going to say. The, uh, oh, my sweet summer tire, how little you know about the rigors of the road ahead. Oh, they're funny. They're funny because it's kind of a Game of Thrones reference, I guess. Maybe a Game of Thrones reference. Oh, boring. No, that's, that's a... Phew, I've not played Sekiro. We're not going that far, my friend. Um, I mean, well, I'm, I'm in the same camp as so far as I, I never really tried it. Like, I never thought to try because it didn't interest me as much as proper Soulsborne games. So, but I, I'd be willing to try it eventually. Just, there's so much going on. There's so much out at the minute. I've barely played any games from this year because I was catching up with um, Baldur's Gate. Um, and, yeah, oh my god, it's still in park. Got to switch it to drive. No gears, though. That would be too complicated. What about Woe Long? Again, um, Woe Long Sweet Chariot. Uh, right, it's um I was trying to think of another pun, sorry. <laughs> brain, brain no working today. Okay, we'll pull her in here. That seems fine to me. Uh yeah, again, like looks very interesting. Um it just a lot of other colour stuff going on. Colour stuff going on, you know. Um I love the Free Kingdoms. Uh Total War Free Kingdoms was questionable, I say how much. Um but again, that's, that's, that's maybe unfair. I'm not blaming myself. So, uh, do, 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 do. King Wendo looks like the, uh, the crankshaft is uh, fractured and don't even get me started on a drive fuse. It's going to cost about 500 quid. I'm not sure you want a rush order, then we're looking at uh, 4,000 euros. Yep, that's that's about my experience with the. Uh, that's exactly what I was going to say, actually. Um, James, I know you barely played it, but Tunic is coming to PS Plus. Do you think I should play it? Should I wait for Tunic instead? Ah, oh, well, I'm not even aware of Tunic. What's a Tunic? I don't know, mate. Still got 172 sidepunk streams ahead. <laughs> we can't try... We can't start Sekiro now. Sekiro now. You're right. You're right. Um, yeah, where along's... Uh, I heard very good things. I think it was um, that and another similar game that's come out recently. One of them was like... Like, they, they both seemed to be quite good but one of them had uh you know just a slightly better reception overall than the other i think the other was like you know you're looking at like 80 you know 8 out of 10 sort of material uh 7 to 8 so uh 2 2 to nick 3 2 4 nick this is what why is why is nick getting three twos these are more than three twos right okay <laughs> Let's, uh, let's focus on this instead of chatting a load of absolute nonsense. I know, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy. So we are fixing up a car right now. Cool cool music, cool vibes. Um, but yes, Cooly Woody, I would absolutely... Uh, I would recommend Tunic. It's not that long a game, despite the fact that we, uh, you know, played it quite a long time on quite a few streams. Uh, that was mainly because, hey, what? You can you can check these, can you? Okay, fair enough. Um, but yeah, if you're playing it normally and you know not just segregated for like two hours a week, um, yeah. Oh. Six nine uh, six two nine. Nick. Um, not nice. Nah. <laughs> Oh, I see what you're going for, Silo. Like, it's just the auto mod is, you know, caught that. <laughs> um, Tunic's only about six months on. Exactly. Really like Death Store, so I thought Tunic was pretty sick. Yeah, I've not played Death Store, but it does. It does look very similar, doesn't it? Uh, Tunic's got that that cool Souls-like element of just wandering around and like nothing's outright explicitly explained to you. Um, and yeah, maybe it's more sort of Zelda vibes than. than souls but it, it has that sort of feeling to it um and then you got to piece together like the the whole thing with the the manual that you've got to collect pages for and slowly get more of an idea of what's going on that's really cool love that love that um what we're we doing again something in the blueprints oh yeah, yeah, yeah okay so we can pick this up and we've got there we've got a mechanics kit so the bottom left there it's shown prior bar and duct tape so the important thing is that i guess crowbar I'll pop that right over here, mate. 
Yeah, pop this down here, mates. Lovely. Yeah, you got a bit of uh, inventory management as well. Inventory. Car maintenance. What we need, what we're looking at right now. Um, so I know I was a bit like overwhelmed with the inventory a little bit there. Uh, yeah, we're looking at equipping, equipping that first. Did I not equip that? Okay, fair enough. Uh, you can assign these to any one of four quick slots. There we go. Bam. Oh, look at us. We're doing the half-life. Oh, yeah. Whack, whack, whack. We need inventory management again. Always, always. Look away for a minute and where's the car? No. Oh, no. The car's right here, don't you worry. <laughs> Play Death Store, it's amazing. I know, it's on, it's on my list of things to do, but I did, you know, I only recently, like, fully completed Baldur's Gate, so uh, leave me alone, all right? So, yeah, uh, a lot of the game is sort of your your fine containers you gotta like loot stuff to to craft various bits to help you and your car and stuff like that so there's there's that element to it that's a big part of the, the overall loop um dude where's my car which car dude so we can, i guess what this is fun it's a friendly dumpster if you're ever in dire need pay us a visit as much as the zone takes away sometimes she also provides um, sick. That's very, very important. What we've just got there. That's our, that's our good friend, the scrapper. So, uh, not as you like. Oh, you're looking for a scrap, mate. Lovely guy. Lovely, lovely, friendly. Oh no, we don't, we don't want to cut you up. Um, so now we can scrap the abandoned car. Something that I didn't do. Bam! Oh, it starts to get a bit when we break stuff. That's interesting. Um, probably just because we got the, the stream and everything going as well. Uh, what I did notice is that you can just, you know, probably scrap this computer as well, right? Yeah, lovely. All these various different bits and bobs. So you see how it's kind of like a survival game in a weird way? Uh, collecting lots of various materials. But what I love about this, and we'll get to in a bit, is the, the weird vibes. Oh, weird vibes going on. What's going on in the uh, exclusion zone, you know? Alright, scrap, scrap. Are we on our to-do list? Yeah, we've got enough to make a door now. Can we, can we break that? We can't. Okie dokie. Dumpster can be friendly now. I could play original Age of Empires 2 with that computer. Well, not anymore, because I scrapped it, okay? So, <laughs> I'm sorry. I mean, Age of Empires 2 is classic. You can't, you can't knock it. Um, uh, where do we stand on dude, gender-wise? What, you mean, as in the actual word? Is it neutral or only male? Because I love calling all genders dude, because I'm very 90s. <laughs> well, that, I, I treat it the same as, like, you know, got whole, hey, guys, I rather than specifying like guys and girls and then specifying other as well like guys is a catch-all term i think but um it depends if people aren't comfortable and that's that's fair enough uh but i think that's that's something that you'd you know not big deal is it either way surely uh that's coming from my very you know limited perspective though so i appreciate that so we could bop this on back we don't need a trunk door. We need a rear right door. Boom, boom, boom. Sorted. Hey, caramba, dude. Dude, it's for everyone. There we go. We have it. Officially, Lord Brodovich has declared. <laughs> uh, I if, if a mod says it, then I trust it. I trust the mod. That's legit, yo. Uh, what are we looking for again? Oh, yeah. So, so this one's the repair putty. Uh, yeah, I think guys could be neutral. But I said dude, isn't it? I don't know. There's Rubik on these things. Dude, dude, how you like? Do it, 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 dude, be like that. You know? We've been hashtag modded. <laughs> oh, speaking of modded, I've been very excited. I think I was talking about it last week a little bit. Very excited to, to try and set up a modded playthrough of um, a Fallout game. Guess what? Is it going to. So that's, that's the repair play, okay. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be that one, what everyone rants and raves about. I think it's going to be New Vegas. I'm, I'm gonna do that. No, that's the wrong button. So I'm still a bit unsure about all the controls and stuff, but I'm getting there. Oh, I'm getting there. 
We'll take a spare tire. Thank you. Thanks, Brosef. Is 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 Brosef marathon up? <laughs> Guys. Guys, is it is it gay to kiss a girl? <laughs> this reminds me of those jokes somehow. Oh, I feel like dude's gender neutral, but I understand why some uh Amab ladies don't care for it. Yeah, that's fair. Try to take it out of the vocabulary. Modded 66 run. Immediate ban, let's go. Yeah, yeah, King Rando. We'll, we'll go on Fallout. We'll mod it so much that we'll mod Fallout 76 into Fallout 666. Bros of Stalin, dude. I tried Fallout 1 and I didn't really understand. I did try that many years ago. Um, and I, I get it, but it's like it was just, it's just a bit too old school. And I'm bloody old, you know, so I get why people are like can't quite vibe with this because um i think again anything if you mod a few things to make it a bit more user friendly a bit more modernized it, then yeah you could absolutely play it and you know i think uh people should experience the old fallout games because from what i've seen and heard and I've, I've played a little bit i played up to like shady sands which is the first area not too long into it i i get why people absolutely adored the game and why it's popular enough to you know Go, go places. It, it went places. You know. um, sorry, I'm just, just missing. The <laughs> chat's going bloody crazy up here. Um, I'll, I'll take his dudeness or or, or dude uh, or El Duderino if you're not into the whole brevity thing. El Duderino. El Duderino. Dude or dudettes. I'm a big fan of uh, dudette. Yeah. You've got the wrong Lebowski, mate. Uh, <laughs> I'm the dude, man. Been back and forth playing Fallout 4 and 76. Good, good, good. Is 76 uh, fixed now, according to Idris Elba? That's, that's what I've heard. Kind of surprised you haven't tried the Resident Evil deal of remake the first two. Well, you'd think that, but that would be Bethesda making a good decision, and they haven't done that in a little while, have they? <laughs> they, as I, I sort of mentioned the other day, um, the fact that they're... We got to see that cinema. <laughs> yeah, nice. Ah, oh, you saw you saw the big Lebowski. Nice. To be honest, I've not seen all of the big Lebowski, um, and that's criminal, I know. But I still maintain that I've seen more films than you know than especially the the, the lads, the the dudes specifically, um, because I'm just editing all those games now, and it's very much uh, oh, have we seen this film? Of course we haven't. What do you think? <laughs> Um, but yeah, uh, it is good. Like, I've seen bits of it, and I was, you know, as well as, like, the very, very popular clips. What are we doing again? We want to, we want to equip this, don't we? We're doing a repair party thing, aren't we? Sorry about that, guys. I'm, it's fine. You know how it be. <laughs> That's how we fix things. Splodge. Oops. Uh, technically, wait, 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 went all over the place. California, California, again, yeah, Washington, D.C., Nevada, Boston, most of the I'll technically try as well. What do you mean? For, for, the, for the Fallout games, right? James! The Big Lebowski is amazing. I'm not a movies person at all. I know! I know it's amazing! I've seen some of it! <laughs> I'm just saying! I need to give it, you know, if this was a long time ago at uni, and I was not paying attention. So I, I only claim, you know, I've seen bits of it. It's one of those, you know? Uh, but look, look at this magic pace, everybody. Look how cool that is. I love the fact that the damage is, um, like, you can scan things and double check, but I think there might even be a setting in the game where you can, like, you rely purely on the, the visual feedback, which is super cool as well. Love that. Um, so I think the, um, like I said, it, it's very sort of tactile, this game. Or certainly tries to be. Uh, and from what, I, from what I've seen so far, yeah, I like that. I like the fact that, yeah, you've got to fix up specific parts. It um, gives you that sort of, uh, what's the game literally called? There was a game a while ago that was kind of like, you know, go on a road trip, fix up your old crappy car. And I think it was literally called um, Jalopy, which is a great word. Uh, Basically means um, we'll scan the flat tire. So now we can scan things. See, there we go. So we got a flat. That's one of many, many statuses you can get. So if you've got a problem with one tire, it might be flat. It might be something else entirely. Um, fortunately, remarkable advances in tire patch technology means this can be repaired in no time at all. 
Uh, yeah, we'll say. Um, I've got now. Bloody hell. Yeah, it's uh, yeah, jalopy means uh, an old beaten up car that's barely running. <gasps> jalopy. This stuff must be the alien epoxy stuff before that video goes worth it. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Now we have two options. We can use that spare tire that we've got. Which ram I like to craft a uh, what is it? It was a ceiling kit, right? So we go into this, we're going to blueprints. So I'm still, yes, it's this one. So we can pin that if we want to make sure we know what we're trying to do here. Duct tape, rubber, and glass shards. I love the fact that the icon for rubber is uh, a little rubber ducky. Ooh. Okay, right, let's do this. Um, jalopy, hey, you jalopy. <laughs> it sounds like, uh, you know, it does sound like a slur, but like a, uh, <laughs> Not, not an aggressive one. More like a silly... Uh, ah, yeah, silly jalopy. Oh, right. You absolute jalopy. Stop me jalopy. I mean, that just sounds filth. That sounds disgusting. Sounds worse saying like that. Oh, yeah, that's me kicking it. I keep wanting to press X to pick things up, but uh, there we go. Oh, that's a wrecked car. There we go. Oh yeah, some of these some of these uh, things have like their own little logs and stuff. So uh, yeah, hey, well, not as bad as uh, Lucy B. I'm not even touching that with a ten foot barge bolt. That's I'm I'm not saying it. You can't make me. Uh, I told him not to bring his own car. Told him the third. How long does it last? How long do you think it lasts? What is? Can we not scroll down? It looks like that's a scroll bar there. Maybe not. Okay. Uh, Mm. Sweet summer tie. And they literally make the joke in the, the little logbook thing about that. It's very good. But yeah, we can scan all sorts of stuff. Give us a little bit of info. Um, don't know whether that's necessarily um, pivotal to what you need to be doing. Uh, oh, I've already got enough stuff that we need. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. We'll collect everything. Yeah? Perfect. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. 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 Um, hey, praying us a lot. Afternoon to you, and you specifically. How you doing? Hope you well. Uh, we are playing a little bit of um, fix up your jalopy simulator before we get to the the really weird stuff. We're almost through the uh, tutorial, I do believe. So we're just going to do this. Uh, we can craft important stuff here, and this is where we'll be coming back to. Basically, this is our little like home away from home. How's the praying going? <laughs> you gotta watch out for a praying ocelot. Um, is, is, is it like, you know, praying mantis or praying, praying mantis? Boom! We done it. We did it. We fixed the loose wheel. We're a genius. We are officially a mechanic now. So this one has a loose wheel. So that status is wobbling. Of all the components you have in your car, this is certainly one that you don't want to work itself free. Uh, yeah, the wheel. No, you don't want that. You do not want that at all. Uh, Looking forward to the weekend. Yeah, you know it. You know it. It's happening. And if you vote for me, the weekends will be longer every single week. Um, a vote for me is a vote for a longer weekend and lots of fun stuff. Right. Uh, what, what, wait, 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 wait. What are we doing again for this one? How do we, how do we, sorry, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to scan that again. Uh, the fix is the mechanics kit. Yes, okay, okay, gotcha. Um, again, I'm still, you know. But I really, I really like the music. Really adds to the vibe to this one. A vote for Jones is a vote for Jones. Exactly. True words have never been said. I say fix stuff, you know? I say fix stuff. Let's go. Oh, is it bad that... I was thinking this last night when I was playing it. That little bit of the song, that little... Um, what would you call it? Not a refrain. Like a little motif. Uh, 
That did sound like down, down, down by the river because I have, you know, that's been my life non stop. Just the, uh, well, not non stop, that's half the problem. It took me so long. So I did stop several times, but yeah. Uh, Boulder's Gate is now fully gated up and bolded. And uh, all is right with the world. Just pro good and anti bad, exactly. Thank you, Cooly Willy. Hook it up to your car, wherever it'll fit. Excellent. James, what are your policies on abortions and miniature American flags? Uh, <laughs> we say yes. To, oh, I can't remember what, what the quote was now. I know what you're going at. Um, uh, the reasonable amount. No, no, no. Um, abortions for some, miniature American flags for others. Oh, yeah, we got it. We got it in the end. Um, my my policies are Simpsons quotes accurate for some, vaguely accurate for others. Woo! <laughs> hate miniature flags makes country look tidy. It's your North Star and the only well, way I hate when they get the colours wrong. Heck, you should consider it the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit if you plan that. on staying alive. That's how important this thing will be to you. Excellent. Yes, that's, that's, that's this. my very own invention. Contraption right here, by the way. I'll tell you more about it if you live long enough to use it. I will. I will live so long. You don't, you don't even know, mate. You don't even know. Um pick up the gear blueprint so sweet we've got some gear blueprints as well oh yes lovely yes that looks good i can use a gear and an impact hammer which is going to be useful very shortly so view blueprint and we can oh that's the first aid kit where was it it's this one isn't it we kind of want that oh use the pump to fill up the fuel tank right that's the last thing i forgot there is a few more steps do. Isn't that lovely? Isn't that lovely? And you know what's the most fun about this whole system? Uh, hear that? Oh, 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 pop! <laughs> it's just, it's very, um, very tactile. It's like, uh, you know, all your dime a dozen sim games, but there's actually more to it than just a fix up car for, for its own sake. Well, at least, well, I think so. I hope so. Yeah, there's there's mystery in the story. If you're all set, take a look at the projector against the wall. Yep, I bloody will. Technically correct, the best kind of correct. James, stop playing with your nozzle. Hey, it's my Friday. I'll play with my nozzle when I want. Goodbye, Ben. Have a good weekend, everybody. Everybody wish Ben a good weekend. Um, James is a menace. No, no. This is the zone. Not one. Within these borders, this all matter the has lost the ability to hold a constant physical state. This what that means this is, is the shape, oh. size, and makeup of just about everything constantly changes. <laughs> a mile of grass can turn into ten miles of swamp in the blink of an eye, and it does yep. constantly. It does. It's caused by Doesn't something need. we call instability. We're completely surrounded by it, and once you've watched it chew through entire mountain ranges, you'll understand mm. that you don't want to get anywhere near it. Yeah. We can only survive in here within pockets of stability. Uh, ben is less infected now, it's all good. <laughs> Happy week, Ben. Very good. <laughs> on the route planner. If we're going to find you a way out of the zone, mm -hmm. you'll mm -hmm. need to build a new antenna. Until then, you won't be able to detect stabilized routes beyond your immediate area. So, okay. you've got to go hunting for parts, and that means taking a drive. Taking on, a drive! The device in your car will then Lovely. show you where you need to go. Okay. Well, I took a little bit longer than I think it did for me last night. Um, just because, you know, we're messing around. We're chatting, we're chilling, you know. We're almost, almost at the weekend. It's chill vibes. And this game is mostly chill vibes, apart from when it's creepy vibes. And when it's creepy vibes, you gotta, you got to get running. you got to get... Well, not running, you got to get driving. That's what you need to do. Um, right, here's what I did, which I think is probably the smart move, right? You can't... You, you you gotta have, oh, for God's sake. Right. sir, sir. Thank you. Very um, sensitive stick there. Um, you gotta have your spare tire. You've gotta come with a spare tire, just in case. Um, 
Jim's Jenkins, it is indeed, or close enough, <laughs> Tetsuayo. I mean, according to the law, I, I only sort of realised this fairly recently, but apparently there's there's been further developments of the law where I am, um, you know, multiple multiple versions they 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 fire me and shut me down and then and then a new one spawns in this place and i can safely say i don't remember any of that in fact i don't remember much before last week so that's probably a problem but it's fine but no i am me it is not a um uh sixth day or is it, what's the film i think there's there's a film with arnie i think it's called sixth day and uh, no spoilers, but it's definitely not about what we just talked about. Okay, that's a good film. See, that's a good. That's a bloody good film. Did I miss Ben? Oh no, no, he didn't pop in. He was just he was waving from the door. Uh, sweet, so we can craft in the back here. We've got plenty of storage in our car. Are we ready to go? I think we're ready to do a little road trip, everybody. Get to the jumper. Put the cookie down. Ah. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> That's enough of that. That's enough of that one. Unless maybe a few more. Don't don't encourage me, Thomas. The memory loss is just functional alcoholism. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. Oh, bloody hell. Warning. Uh, hi, something. Uh, R-level facility. Extreme caution advised. <laughs> I laugh at extreme caution. I'm schooling. Uh, with an X stream caution. I have an X called stream caution. <laughs> Ben's too famous to show up on stream. Exactly. He needs to be whisked away. Um, you know, someone put put someone over the head, like keep keep away from all the paparazzi and whisked away to their to his lovely uh, limo. His limousine bike, obviously. It's just tandem. It's just, a, it's just tandem bike. It's just a, a long bike. Uh, okay, so we've got that locked in already. Um, as you can see, there's there's a lot of stuff on the right. We're kind of blocking a little bit, but it's not super important. Uh, we'll, we'll we'll get to it. Okay, so now we're traveling. We be traveling. Only elite streams can get Ben guest experiences like a Lord Brotvich. Yeah, I know. That's um that's high end. That is. A tandem bike that you're riding. So. <laughs> okay. Now I'll be curious to see if the map's different. Okay, newbie. So I believe I'll it's keep this simple. Uh, procedurally find those materials by any means necessary. <laughs> no one's coming back ever again. So go on and take what you need. Transports, <laughs> homes, outposts, facilities—they've all been abandoned since oh the days. zone was decommissioned in '87. Most of those structures won't even be there the next time the instability scrambles the area. So loot to your heart's content. Just loot away. Just loot away. Just loot away. That's all we gotta do. Yeah. Yeah. So the map is different each time. So that's that's part of it. It's kind of like uh, a bit of a a roguelike aspect to it. There. Um, I know I might put off some people. You know, some people are just not. You know, wouldn't be into this sort of thing. But I'll say, from the little I have played of it. Uh, there are some subtle story beats to it, at least at the very beginning. Don't know if we're going to find anybody later on. We've had some radio chat for now, but ooh, bloody hell. Uh, well, Look this, at you. this is Out quite simple. Zone, all on your own. I think they the map's just so fast, don't they? Oof. And I'll be back at the helm. Been a long time, old gal. Time, old gal. Didn't think we'd uh, talk again after that whole Sasquatch incident. Yes, I was hoping yeah, to go Ben's another decade really without hearing your voice James again. Whoa, you you really guess that? Francis to death. Hello to you too, Oppie. The map is different each time, here. isn't it? Just dyslexia. Yeah, maps, maps, Lexia. The Octavice is picking up on some plasma generators nearby. Your headset has a built-in scanner. Yeah. Use it on the plasma generator, and right. it'll figure out the tools you need. So yeah, so that's that's what we that's what we got to do. So we got to do this. Hang on, we can also scan this. I think. I thought we could. Yeah, so we can scan a lot of stuff and just be like, what, what, danger? What do you mean danger? Huh? Okay. Why danger? Why be in danger? Um. But yeah, Kalibali, that's, that's, that's the trick to it. 
See, um, uh, my rates are distinctly less expensive. Uh, further to my correspondence of the 24th, I'm right to advise each and every one of you uh, that the forthcoming disco time will not be going ahead. Moreover, I'm extremely disappointed that I find it necessary to remind all employees that inappropriate and unauthorised use of ARDA equipment is very obviously a violation of organisation policy. Not to mention profoundly unprofessional. Oh dear. Uh, lighting rigs, arrays, spotlights and racks that we've requisitioned are precisely calibrated, specially constructed, magnetically shielded sodium devices that are both very sensitive and extremely expensive. They are specifically designed to work in zone conditions for remote deployment and to withstand radiation EMP. They are not for modifying with coloured filters, rainbow banners or beach synced variable resistors. Oh bloody, it's a woke karate again, you mentioned a rainbow. <laughs> uh, Man, thankfully less of that uh, in the near future because they're all getting bloody voted out. <laughs> um, frankly, I'm appalled that I have to compose a memo such as this when I find those responsible, uh, which I shall rest assured there will be severe consequences. This is the Olympic exclusion zone, not Miami Beach. All right. Well, I hope hey, you all uh, learned the lesson. Uh, now. Oh, this is interesting. Okay. Uh, looks like what it's ripe for the picking. Can't get at it with your hands, though. An impact hammer will do the trick. Uh, oops. Oh, oh no! Oh no, did we interrupt the remnant talk? Oh, that's annoying. Hopefully that crops up again, because that's actually kind of important. But whatever. Impact hammer. Yeah, okay. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, we need to... Basically, have a look in various places. So let's go, merge around. We'll scan some stuff. No big deal. Bosh, bosh, bosh. Uh, we don't need to know too much about what the things are. You can sort of check them should you wish. Oh hell yeah, hell yeah. Supply containers. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Look in here. So as far as I'm aware. These various different coloured things like that. Oh, you can also like uh, rotate as well. So, yeah. Um, yeah, these are mostly crafting materials, from what I could tell, and sort of separate out to different sort of categories, I believe. Maybe, maybe. Um, what do we? What do we? What do we? Use a healing item. What? Is it because I've been... Oh, that's what the danger was. I was legit in danger for some reason. Why? Why? Wow. Because I was standing too close to that. I didn't notice, but top left. <laughs> my, um... Yeah, so I, I'm on, like, not a lot of health right now. <laughs> Whoopsie. Okay. We'll equip this, right? Oh, we can use it. Wow, amazing. Can you smash glowy thing? Oh, we gonna smash glowy thing. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. So, in order to do this, we need to craft a couple of gears. Luckily, it sort of sets up automatically for you, so you can do that. You can do that. And now we've got enough to make the actual thing, the impact hammer, a Bosch. And now, Check this out. Whoop. Punk. Okay. Now. now. Watch this drive. First of all, we've, yeah, we've already scanned that. Whoop. Punk. Oh, God, it does start a little bit. Didn't have that problem at home, though, so it might be a, a stream thing. That looks rude. What do you mean? What do you mean, like, the Ultra Penetrator 3000? Looks mean. Looks, looks rude. <laughs> I don't, I don't know what you mean, mate. <laughs> this is perfectly normal. Oh. Oh no! This has already been smashed. Well, that's different from last time. Also, uh, interesting. Interesting to see there. Okay. Get bonked. Get bonked, son. Now, we can potentially smash in through here, right? Yes, we can. Amazing. That's also new. I think we can maybe break in with... Uh, our crowbar as well, but uh, yeah. Bam, bam, bam. Uh, 
down here. Nothing new about toolboxes. I mean, it is. It is. What else? What is this one? Aha! We have light. Ah. Locked basic. Uh, yeah, a fix is a pry bar. Or, although we could also apparently use the um, the 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 door flipper. <laughs> I was always going to swear. Um, the door flipper 3000. Ah, the big girthy penetrator 3000. <laughs> What's no? Okay, no, we're keeping things PG. I don't know what you're talking about, huh? Smash nine thousand. Uh, prior, pry, uh, pry bar, crowbar, whatever. Oh, you just dropped that. That's handy. Yeah, there we go. Oh, is it steady? Sorry, sorry. Oh, no, no, the mob's banning the mob. No, please, guys, please. Oh, uh, kick. Guess what? You can throw things. Uh, wait, what is it? Is that this? We see ya. Um. Good. That that just pockets it, right? Bam! Chemicals, gas cylinder. Good job we didn't, you know, pump the gas in. So that would be good. Bam! Bam! Uh, no, our flare has disappeared. Hello. Ugh. What happened? What? What's happened to our car? What's going on? What is that thing? Did it? Did it just move my car? Sir? You banned no weekend for you for two weeks? No, you can't say that. You don't have the authority. Oh, no, this bike might have the authority. Oh. Um. So, yeah. That's all. N I just dropped my bloody thing, didn't I? Um. Pressing the wrong buttons. That's right and center. There you go. That's how you see so yes, yeah. things do change. Things do get Happy different. It's a valet. Happy 20 BBBB blazing my dudes, Lord <laughs> yeah, 16 down. Yeah, you know it. Oh, we are driving. So here are some driving jokes to get us to our goal. Yeah, 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 what yeah, kind yeah. of car does Jesus drive? A Chrysler. Ha ha ha. <laughs> what kind of car does a famous sushi chef drive? A Rolls Royce. Hi. -e. Oh, very Why good. Why couldn't the ghost drive his car? He couldn't find his spookies. Ho ho ho. What kind of a car does an egg drive? A yoke swagon. How? Which part of the I car guess. is the laziest? The wheels, because they are always tired. Hi, who? <laughs> Moggy road trip. Moggy yeah. road trip. Beautiful work. Beautiful work. Be 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 Close to it. Right, so you're in danger there. So we do lose health. We lost a lot of health, actually. We gotta, we gotta keep an eye out here. So we can just press right stick to transfer everything. That's very easy. Love that. Love a bit of that. Um, thank you very much. We will. Why are we in danger still? Oh my god. Uh, we're still losing health, but we're safe here. What? Is it just if we're too close to that thing? Oh my god, I don't know. I give up. I'm going over here. Oh hey, can we... Can we... That's crude door. Poor bit bloody crude, isn't it? Uh, right. Danger. Again! So much danger we're in. I just... Uh, I wish it would tell us on the UI. I'm surprised it doesn't. Oh no, it does actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, top left. So that that radiation thing, that's clearly happening. Danger is always around the corner. The question is which corner. Yeah. Um, of course, I should say thank you as always to uh, to Lord Brodovich and Stephen for uh, for the excellent blipples, the excellent jokes, and the good bees. The good bees. Solid bees. That's a solid bee. Yeah. Right. Uh, more road flares. Um, I'd like to not be irradiated all this time, please. There's a way to get in here, actually. Plonk! <laughs> Amazing. Look at that. Would you get a load of that? Uh, right, we'll... 
Because this crafting stuff isn't super... We're just being very thorough at the minute. Can we get through there? We can't. That's weird. Toolbox. Done that. Okay. Right. Get loads of stuff. Let me... Out of here! <laughs> Fantastic. Um, I should probably press that button again so it doesn't reset. Okay, cool. Wait, is that gonna... Good. Good. Just checking. Just checking. No problem. Oh, we, uh, we at danger levels now. We at danger levels. Can we just, you know... I see. So it's much more apparent when we're actually driving, which is cool. Uh... I'll tell you what else is very cool. The mirrors just operate perfectly like like they should. It's very good. Okay, right. We're outside of the danger zone here. This has already gotten more dangerous than it was last time. Uh, which is kind of crazy. Right, put that in there. We've got that in the hands. Put that. God damn, I've got to use another first aid kit. Bloody hell. That's okay. That's okay. We need to get more... That's what we need to do. Um, we're probably better off crafting with the first aid kit, to be honest. Um, a scrapper. We need a scrapper. Mechanics kit, crude bumper. A lot of these things I think will be more apparent as we go through. Um, so yeah, we can we can crack on now. This is interesting as well. I've not not gotten so far as to. I think they're like, yes, yeah, his abilities. Um, other stuff here. Don't know what that means. It says XD. Huh. So such like early internet XD. Lol. Right. We're gonna collect materials. I'm gonna replace the parts we already. Leave, but yeah, uh, we just gotta explore this. Um, don't like that. Don't like that. Please, please no. You're gonna, you're gonna pick us up, aren't you? You're gonna be weird. Oh God, they're being weird about this. Please stop being weird about this, sir. Oh no, he's picked us up. He's chucking us. Stop that. Stop. Stop. Please. Can we reverse and un unclamp ourselves? Oh my God. Uh, right. Roar, XLD, XD, Rufflecopter, are we there yet? <laughs> um, that was very much a, a Rufflecopter moment. We almost became a copter. Jesus Christ. So, uh, yeah, that was interesting, huh? A normal Seattle citizen. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, uh, this is an anomaly. We already saw another one. We couldn't quite get to scan it though. I don't know if we can scan whilst in the car or just outside. I don't know. We've got a spark tower. Uh, plus a powered spark transmitters committing, uh, combining previously obsolete calls with the, 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 the best way to boost signals throughout the zone. Constant increase in radiation electromagnetic interference has made radio communication extremely difficult and often, often subject to bizarre distortions. New modified calls appear to have solved that. The addition of local plasma power sources is a reliable way to keep each node within this vital infrastructure, both operational and independent. However, the price you have to pay is constant maintenance repair, demanding beasts, spent for components. Um, cool. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Oh, well done, everybody. I hope you're all proud of yourselves. Went to school with an anomaly, or anomaly. <sighs> You lot need to be out yourself, right? So this is Spark Tower. And, uh, Sparky and George, but what we're going to do is we're just going to go... Boop, 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 plonk! Oh no, I think we got shocks! Ow! It, now, if you get your car too close to this, I might try and demonstrate this, but... Um, like, parts of the car might become electrically charged. Which, to me, sounds like a bad idea, a bad thing. And an old Melly. I wasn't uh, wasn't an O'Malley in um, in Bewitched. Who does? Who does? 
<laughs> no, wait. I can't, I can't do the accent. Dad's like me dad. <laughs> you fight like me dad. Right. There we go. Don't, don't tell Kieran I did that. Don't tell me off. I'm a, I'm a quarter door now. I can get away with it, alright? I have precedent. <laughs> it's still Marley the alley cat. Hey, you're Marley. Um, I don't like this. Can we leave the, leave the engine running? Yeah, probably. If we do leave the engine running and one of those other weird things pops up again, I will not be best pleased. What's in there? What's the green stuff over there? It's not just us, right? Yeah, so this is, uh, this is also why um, I don't think anyone has commented on the, the stream name, but that is why I, uh, I, I saw the pun somewhere. So it's, it's not my, my own creation, but it is very good. Uh, store like car. One of the old gorilla radio stations. That ought to be because it's like for uh, Stalker parts. Shadow Shinobi. I've loaded games. its approximate it's location to your map. Look for an antenna tower uh, up on a hill somewhere. Uh-huh. Not all those weird things, right? Uh, cool. So we've collected the materials for the antenna. I'll just show my age because I watched the Aristocats again. Oh, yeah, I watched the Aristocats. It's good. That uh, was great. As was Top Cap, which I think is even older. Well, about the same, isn't it? Uh... I don't, I don't know much about it. That's it. Anyone born after 1967 could watch it. <laughs> oh, oh, if you want to get technical values, if you want to get uh, specific driving values. Okay. Who left this in park? I need to drive quickly and away. Now, um, something I should mention that is probably quite obvious. Like the car starts off. Uh, oh, man, James <laughs> Oh, that's not exactly uh, difficult, is it? Because I'm an old man. <laughs> right, we could get some more of those things, but oh, introduction. No, What's that? My, my, where are our manners? Uh, driver, we never introduced ourselves. No, not you did really. not, Tobias. Tobias Barlow, former Artem maintenance manager. Oh, and um, here with me is Dr. Francis Cook. Hi. I was an uh, R&D scientist Frank researching Cook. limb technology right here in the zone. We live right in the mid zone. Just, just a hop, Probably. skip, and a jump over another big old wall from where well, you're good. at. Oh, Classic. and and that old bat over there? That's Dr. Ophelia Turner, former director yeah. of research and development herself, the mother of limb technology, the maven of electromagnetism. We need limbs. That's enough. Resident Sir? party pooper. Well. Um. What? Uh oh. Uh oh. Can we? Can we scan? Apparently not. Do we want to dare? Yeah, I'm also younger, Joe. Just um, officially not a young anymore. Cooly woolly. Now, well, that makes me feel worse. <laughs> yeah, I'm younger than James, but I'm also not. You know, I'm still old. <laughs> well, that's fantastic. Hi, sir. Sir, I'm just scanning you. Now I'm running away. Okay. I said, of course, it's an abductor. Oh God, run! Oh God, where did we leave our car? It's somewhere over here. Oh my god, I can hear it! This is ageless. I feel like that's a good thing about me. It's coming right for me! Oh my god, it's legit! Ah! Uh, okay, it's turned around, it's turned around. Cool, cool, cool. I don't know how dangerous some of these things are. If they're actually going to kill you outright, I mean, you know, some things actually. You lose your health with, from environmental hazards, so that's certainly a thing. Um, but yeah, uh, in case you didn't realise, you, you have a whole thing where, like, you. you you got to upgrade your car because it's in a, a rough state. And I do believe sometimes the car will do stuff, like the, the steering will start being funny or just be funny because you haven't got the right tyres or equipment on. There's a little bit of, like, sim-like elements to it. But I think also the anomalies do a thing as well. And, uh, you know, we know what anomalies like. It's another anomaly. It's oh, oh my god, it's a pothole! Of course it's bloody council. Not clear that it's potholes, are they? That's why I'm not voting for them. Uh, answer phone message. A bar, so I'm at oh my god, we're danger. We should probably step away from the radioactive materials first before we read any long um, 
where was it? You've got a lot of things. Your car is your shield. Protects you from radiation. Oh, that's good. Okay. Um, I looked at this before, but now it's, you know, it's finally sinking in. Um, car abilities. Nice. Planning a drive. Just, you know, kind of go to the radio passive zone. Yeah, but then they get radio passive aggressive, and I don't, you know, he's, he's got time for that, you know what I mean? Um, I read better when the air is crispy. <laughs> yeah, when it's sizzling. Mm hmm. Oh, here we go. This is about the weird abductor thing, right? Hopefully we're not getting abducted right now because you you can't pause the game when you're looking at a log book. And various stuff. Where was it? Where was it? Uh, these were anomalies. And O'Malley's. Dear Maggie, once again, I miss you and the kids so much. I'm sorry I haven't written suited, but it's just crazy out here. I have a few moments right now, so I figured I'd put... I would be good to put pen to paper. I hope you don't mind Anne Wright being so wiggly, but me and the guys are in a bit of a pickle right now. You see, our van got pulled up into a tree. I'm afraid I can't explain exactly what happened, top secret things and all. But we're safe, trust me on that. We also have two hours to wait before rescue comes, hanging 50 feet above the ground and rather rich. I'll send this as soon as we get back to barracks. And write you a much... What's that sound? Write you a much better letter after, but in the meantime, here's a picture. I sketched it out. Ah, uh, I don't... Oh my god. Um, let's get you out while we're waiting. There's one thing we have up here. It's a heck of a view. Oh, okay, fine. All the potholes. Hey, boss, I'm out here working with Mirror and Tobias for maintenance. I'm afraid I got some bad news about our gear. Run into some trouble. I don't think we're getting it back anytime soon. Bad stuff for my first potholing job. Okay. Uh, everything's taking flight, so to speak. I'm dead serious. You should see this. Um, you know how you told me we were normal people working in a very abnormal place? I think I know what you mean now. Yeah, that's very, um, oh, full of pot. Ba, 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 ba. Uh, what? Oh. <laughs> oh. Um, oh, no, there goes the thing. Well, that's fine. That's probably fine. Okay. So, um, yeah, I, I was going to say, like, the, the, it feels a bit like, um, that's what I find so intriguing about this. There's a lot of mystery and weird stuff going on. It's got a bit of, you know, like the, the, the remedy verse with, you know, Alan Wake and Control, especially Control. Or, you know, like general stuff like, uh, what are they called? SCBs? I don't know, something. But the weird, you know, government secret anomalies and stuff. Always creepy. Always, always like vaguely creepy, but not outright so. A bit, a bit ominous, subtly creepy. Uh, that's kind of this game, you know. Hopefully that makes sense. Okay, so I don't know where we're supposed to go now. Right, hold up, now, hold up, now. just please. Put her in, put her in park. She can't be abducted again. I know you're there. Um, that's where we are at the minute. We just need to locate the... Oh no, that's where we are. Oh, that's where we need to go. So we can shortcut it through here if we want to. Um, um, it's so funny how, like, you've got to do actual driving logic. Um, oh, excuse me, pardon me, pardon me. Excuse me. Uh oh. Are we good? We're good. I think we're good. Oh, not another. Bloody abductors. Bloody abductors all everywhere. We've had enough. I'm going to vote for someone that doesn't have light abductions and stuff, you know? God, that's creepy, isn't it? Is it, is it going to hurt us? Is it just dripping oil and stuff? Um. It's got bloody traffic lights stuck to it. It's just... That's very cool. That's very cool. I like that. Um, okay. I mean, between this and, like, you know, content warning and stuff, there's a lot of, a lot of games out recently with, with weirdness. Just silly weirdness, isn't it? 
Load of bloody silly, silly bollocks weirdness. Why, why can't I find any more of those? We don't need any more of those. Ooh. The fix is an impact hammer. Well, we do have that. So a stronger lock needs a stronger punch. Luckily, we got that. That's also a strong lock. Whoa, bam! Get impacted. We oh, wasn't that close enough to it? Oh, come on, bro, bro! I'm doing the impact hammer, please. Have I got a? Have I got a hit? Specifically, is the aim something that I gotta get right? Uh, it was already open. I wasted many charges of that. That's fine. Um, how do we like this? Surface? There we go. God, it's creepy, isn't it? I'm, I'm less creeped out at the minute because have you guys? You, you dudes and dudettes and dudettes. Dudettes. What's this do? It's a lab computer, isn't it? Hello, glad the office is Dr. Turner. No, we have a Dr. Turner. I got the best that news. radio station's up on a hill somewhere. I know, Oppie. We just, Eyes you know, an El Dudorinos. Yes, that's the most important one. Uh, does this mean that we can, like, just got this? I think we can. Yeah, recommend the tool. Oh, lovely. Distracted anomaly with a light source. That's a thing. Problem is, I'm standing on the light source, so, um. Huh. Okay. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, we can we can throw this. Hey, hey, idiot! Oh my god, it's like Jurassic Park. Yeet! Oh, oh no, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Hey, that's cool. That's cool. Sorry, we still want to go in there. Just realised back on there, we can down straight, man. Up, up. Grab some more stuff. Boop, 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 boop. What's that? That's another pry bar. Lovely. Um, quick, quick pry bar. Uh, Ooh. Well, we can open that, can't we? Oh, for flip's sake. It's fine. I think we, uh. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, no. Inventory's full. Well, we can always carry this back to the car, can't we? Has it? Oh no. Oh no. Stay away from my car, sir. Sir. It's fine. Oh, no. We can pop whatever we've got in our hands in there. That's good. Uh, bam. Oh, look at all that juicy materials up. So I do believe. We should probably crack on with this because we're getting close to the end of the stream and we can't save midway through like a run. It's kind of like, um, I think it's called an invent labor now. <laughs> oh, very good. Very good, bro. Very good. Um, yeah, let's, let's, let's just crack us. We've, we've, we've recovered some stuff, right? You get the five star. Oh. First of all, let's, let's take advantage of our, um, yeah, yeah. And then if we lob this over there, is it gonna, is it gonna, is it gonna? Yeah, it is. Oh, go, 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 drive, drive. Oh my god, I think I put it in park again. Drive. Are we fine? I think we're fine. We're fine. Whoa. Amazing. Yeah, I love that. That's really cool. Uh, let me oot. Wow, that's. Almost wanna, you know, stop and check that. We gotta, we gotta check that. Don't dead open inside, huh? Trash can. I'm the trash man. <laughs> doof, doof, doof. <laughs> better, better go and learn them out then. Uh oh, what's happening? That's just out of line. Something getting freaked out here. I don't like those freaky buggers. I don't know if they've necessarily caused me any harm, but they've caused me a mild inconvenience. Oh boy. Oh my god, it's right there! Stop, Drake! Give me my car! 
Dude! Dude! Oh, for goodness sake. If they're inside, how do you write the sign on the outside of the shell? Oh my god, the far wall. You are very, you make a very good point. You know what I say to that? Um, wizards did it. Just, just don't think about it, it's, it's the wizards. We are in a slight pickle now. It's, uh, to be fair, the car's not that far. But, um, is that tool compensating? So what, what tool? The, the big clonker. The, the big old clonker that we had that's just broke. Because we're silly people and we've used it all on that. So this doesn't matter for right now, does it? Uh, what, what, what was that? What was that? I've got to. Yeah. I don't like them. They're, uh, I'm not friends with them anymore. We're going to have to run all the way over here. Exposed. Ta -ta. No, 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 no. You need your car, dude. <laughs> I was a half fancy act. Better call the police so they can log it in the database and then do nothing else. Yeah, got it. What the bloody hell? A tourist. I don't like that. Um, it's just got weird. Is it going to be like... Oh my god, we're dangerous now. We get outside of the nuclear fallout zone. Those bots pick up artists. Ah, very good. Very good. Uh, Perpetual stability. The instability storm will not be chasing you here unless something. Oh, yeah, okay. I think that just means we're not going to get the things that we had earlier. Down line crafting stats is. It's tourist, okay. This is weird. Uh, hi, Christina. Hi, how are you? So, uh, it turns out you are right. We've had reports from several regions of the zone now, and they're all very similar. We have these dummy things out in the wilderness, and. Um, we also have them inside abandoned houses. We also have them in gas stations, on the road, on top of signs. One report here says on a roof. We've, um, we've spiked about 600 now. File catalogs each and every one. Oh, and you're quite right about the other thing too. Yeah, I know what happens when someone touches one. We've all got plenty of data on that. What? Excuse me? Excuse me? What? Huh? Hello? I d uh, hi, I don't have the data. So um, I'm going to be applying for a position in Portland now. <laughs> I've done my review. It was a great time being contracted here for sure, but I'm sure uh, I'm not sure I want to work out harder full time. You know, it's uh, it's very strange. <laughs> you work in a very strange place. Um, oh God, there's one of them outside. I know for a fact it wasn't there before. That's terrifying. That's terrifying. It's probably going to move. Isn't it? It's going to move. Gonna move. What's a gas station? What about the meter? This is free fuel. And it's only rich should take all it can. That's a good point. Well, we need to find our bloody car first, don't we? It's somewhere over there. So, uh. Let's just crack that open. This is totally fine. We've definitely got enough health. Why was this toilet locked? Well, I don't trust that. We're gonna die out here. We are going to die. I'm gonna die! Uh -huh. Picked clean. Can't get. Can't even get bloody Kit Kat round here. Oh, there's like a beer or energy drink or something. Uh, right, put that sucker up as well. That's to the outside. Good. Oh, 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 there is some. Lovely. We're probably gonna have to heal ourselves pretty soon. Yeah, let's just, let's just get our car in there. Where is it? It's over here. Oh my god, it went so far. <laughs> Those goddamn robots. That was that was pretty funny though. I do like that. Um, cool, we've got some more stuff. The quest for stuff. That's just what it's all about, huh? Oh. Ah, fuel barrels. We can pick up some fuel from here. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Um, I think some things aren't on our regular UI, but um, where we can just yeah, check it like you would a regular car. Can we make another first aid kit? Uh, what else? 
else is there? Okay, this one. Heal ourselves up a bit. Because we have... We just keep walking into, like, the most dangerous areas, don't we? It's a bit silly. What are we on? We've got a decent amount of fuel. I'm gonna... Pick that up. The squidginess is a bit disconcerting, but there we go. Uh, and then we're going to siphon this sucker. Yeah, there we go. We're getting it. I will say the, the controls are a little bit confusing. They, they take a bit of getting used to. Um, but it's kind of like... Um, I don't know. It's a bit like... Obviously not, not the gameplay, but the fact like how the controls are set up are kind of similar to... Uh, or similar vibe to Red Dead. Red Dead Redemption, like, in that that they're, they're not your normal standardised controls, but they kind of make sense after a while, I think, so, uh, alright. Oh, that was already on. See you, boy. Okay. Let's go! We going the wrong way now! Uh, no, we're not. Okay, now I guess we gotta find a way back to the road. Oh yeah, we have a little uh, compass anyway, don't we? So, uh, yeah, harder to see on this screen, but it's all good. It's up there, by the looks, yeah? Sick. You know what we didn't do? We got the fuel right. We didn't actually fill up our fuel tank. So, uh, yeah, there's a lot of... Um, well, you know what? Yeah, I am going to stand by that statement. It's exactly like Red Dead Redemption 2. Because there's a lot of um, little things that you wouldn't think would be included in other sort of games. Like, very, very fit. We've, 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 we've emptied all of that, right? How, how can you tell? It's still making me noise, isn't it? I, I don't know how you can tell. Um, yeah, a lot of like the sort of more mechanical tactile sort of uh, actions, you know what I mean? Right. Maybe you don't want to you know what I mean. Maybe we're talking a load of bollocks, which is uh, likely. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Come on, come on, you silly old guy. You can do it, man. You can do it. We're probably taking... What was that noise? Yeah, because there's a road right there, so let's just, let's just take the scenic route. The game encouraged us to do so. Um, also the horse balls. Yeah, yeah, that's true, because you, there is a point where actually your car's balls uh, shrink or uh, grow depending on the temperature, so that is also a legit thing. Hey, switch on the radio. Absolutely. Oh, is there nothing in here? You know what we're gonna do? Let's grab. Scrap that car. Yeah. Woo! Duct tape. We did actually need some duct tape since there. Uh, gang, I'll be casting my vote for James here officially, and I hope he'll allow me to go into an early weekend as a trade. I mean, politics are all about compromises, I suppose, so... I mean, I'm just gonna have to, in the interest of, you know, pretending to be a good guy just for the for the votes, I'm gonna say, yes, I'm a friendly person. You could absolutely do that, Lord Bravich. I'm taking that away from your allowance next week. Uh, <laughs> I'll go anyway, but I'm hoping for the best. Have a lovely rest of the stream. You too, well, you too. You have a lovely weekend, Lord Bravich. You enjoy it, and... and you know what? You get to have an extended weekend because we do, so why not you as well? And anyone outside the UK. Except for you, you know who you are. You know you know what I'm talking about. Not you, but everyone else, it's fine. Oh boy, yeah, we got it, we got it. Yeah, we got all the good stuff. Uh yeah, have a have a lovely weekend, Lord Bravich. I'll catch you next week, dude. Cool. Right. Uh, I think we make one of these. Ooh, we might be alright to do that. Uh, 
then again, our scrap is almost down. Yeah, so here comes the... Okay, okay. That's, um... That's not too bad. Oh, there's tears as well. Yeah, there's a lot to the UI. Um, which, you know, isn't necessarily for everybody. I think maybe could be slightly clearer, but I think once you know where everything is, you, you get the vibe. They've gone for maybe a little bit more uh, stylistic choice over pure ease and readability. Um, but I don't mind. I don't mind that much. I play enough uh, nerd games with all the uh, nerdy stats and stuff. Like, oh, it's uh, uh, the DGS. Oh. All the numbers. So, uh, yeah. Down one up. Oh, here then. Oh boy. This better be good, and there better not be any horrible things looking to take away my poor car. My little jalopy. Uh, Jill Oppy. Oh my god, maybe that's uh, Oppy's first name. No, I think we, we were told that. That's. Uh, Authorised personnel only. All right, all right. Uh, we tried our best, but you know the sign said, "Better leave her." Uh, screw you. Screw you. Yeah, yeah. We're authorised now. <laughs> anyway, uh, enough of that. Enough of the slight mental breakdown. It's all good. Oh yeah, we need to make another uh, kachunk, a kachunka. What were they called? Impact hammers. We need two more gears. Oh no, wait, we can make loads of gears. Lovely, Lovely stuff. Okay, and now we can uh, hmm, probably uh, rotate, rotate like that. Bam! Oh yeah. And we also want to put that on our hot bar. Bam! Okay. But the sign! Nah, it's a hell with a sign. I wonder if we can just, you know. Yeah! I mean, that's. We've got more pry bars than, you know, impact hammers, so it probably makes sense to do that instead. Huh. I, I would like to climb up there. Huh, let me in! Nah, they, they took out pry bar on me! I'm sure we have more crowbars, but that's that's all right. This does is craft from the things in the box, right? Yeah, it does. It does, it does. One. And another one. And another one. So collect parts from the station antenna. Right. From the station antenna. That. Does it mean literally physically the antenna? We gotta knock it down, maybe? Oh, we do love dumpster. Whoa, loads of stuff. Wait, what was that? Looks like cartons, plastic. Okay. Ah, uh, uh, I see. Uh oh. Time to get moving. The instability's ticking up by the second. Uh oh. But you can't get back the way you, you came. Gotta go. The instability makes all routes one way. Good. And that's where my Octavice comes into play. Huh. It'll that's get you back journey. to the garage, Good. but it needs to be charged first. And to do seems... that, you'll need anchors. Okay. Take a look at the Octavice display. It maps all anchors in the nearby area. Find an anchor and this one? feed it to the Octavice to charge it. Find uh, the but anchor. don't you worry your pretty little head about how it works. Okay. You'll be out of here soon, so... There's no reason to learn more about oh, technology. Oh, my head hurts. Me achy head. Oh, okay, so it tells you whereabouts roughly. But I guess in future, that's just part of the loop that you go through. You gotta do whatever you need to do and then collect. What is it? An anchor. See map legends. Anchor signal. Oh, maybe it'll always pop up. But that's cool. Like that. Shut that door. Thank you. Shut that door. Oh, it's my tree. Oh, thank you. Oh, it's the weird stuck. Oh, it's the no, I don't think, Oh, it's probably because we put it in park. Yeah, you idiot. You absolute idiot. You idiot. Okay, let's 
fine. We can just drive off here and everything will be fine, won't it? Yes. Probably. Ow. It's all good. We didn't we didn't need to go inside that place, right? I'm sure it's fine. Ow jeez Louise! Whoa! Ah. <laughs> oh. Good lord, a tiny test, hey, huh? Yoppy, like, a tiny piece look, of test. I, I keep thinking, the way you're helping our friend here right now seems positively helpful. I, seems like me, you're looking to turn a new leaf or something? The only thing I want to look at is a 12-year-old whiskey and the back of his breecher's okay. head when I send them packing. But isn't wow. it worth taking a detour to run just a tiny Great. little test? Can't think of a worse way to spend my time. Please. Okay. I've seen you manipulate waveforms with your right hand and knock back a double with your Ooh. left. Or am I to understand you've oh, <laughs> lost hell. your touch? What I'm understanding is that you won't shut the hell up until I test this remnant. <laughs> yep. Fine. Stop crowding my frequency. What? Yeah. Wait, really? Harpy, darling, you've never given this oh, my easily. Doors are What's what's going on? Is this my door's Francis? Uh, yes? How have you not thrown him to the bunnies by now? Huh. <laughs> 80 years old and only getting sharper by the day. You're a legend. You're a role model. Right, I'm giving you 10 seconds to get out of my... Okay, okay. Uh, we're signing off. <laughs> hey, driver. Good Fantastic. luck out there. Uh, and watch out for the bunnies. They are a doozy. The bunnies? What do you mean? What do you mean? Stop giving them weird, quaint names when really they're probably way more sinister. Uh, okay. Oh my god, what's that over there? No, it's another one of them! Um, yeah, this is cool. This is very cool. Uh, anchors, saucepan, enormous pastry. Those anchors may here. look like glowing balls of magic, but it's Limtech through and through. Limtech. Don't be scared. They haven't exploded in anyone's face. The woman's voice feels familiar. I was thinking Recently. that. I don't know where from though. Definitely familiar. Okay, so what are we what are we doing here? Anchor plug. Oh, we're in a danger zone. Uh cool. Um uh, press the button here. I'm gonna take it. Oh boy. We've kind of messed things up, haven't we? Why do I get the feeling that we've got a we've got a book here, you know? Ow! No, don't throw my thing! What happened there? Oh my god. Oh, I see. I've got to go around here. Plug it in, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, no, no, please. Everything's going to No, stop that. Give me my car back. <laughs> oh my god. It's amazing. So only activate when you're absolutely ready to leave. You do not want to get caught in the storm that follows. What happens? I don't even know what we're what are we doing. What are we doing? Right, it's like the gateway coordinates on the map. Okay. Um. Dude. Dude. Right, thank you. This is hilarious. Tara Langella. I don't know who that is. That's a voice actress. Okay. Yeah, I'm not I'm not sure either, but, um, right, the gateway? Okay, let's like, we'll just go to that one. Down, you see that? that glowing pillar into the sky? Drive into it. Yes, it looks like hot death, yeah. but it's so much ah, better over than there. getting scrambled by the instability. Huh. Well, we've got to get past this asshole first. This asshole! Oh, jeez! So, why do I get the feeling that you've got to, like, make it there within a time limit? That felt like, a uh, boom, you've done something major, now get there quick. Like, Exit. Oh my god, it is as well. Look at the map. Look at the map. Oh my god. <laughs> it's. Oh Jesus. It's like every single battle royale. What year is this? Is this, is this 2018? Don't, don't you, don't you slip. Somebody get in there. Hey, we're done. Jesus, it's not too bad timing either. I think that's pretty good. Oh! Sick. Oh, no, 
Uh, not oh, be as nice as James starts calling people a holes. I'm sorry. Alive. <laughs> oh, I apologise for, for my mm. for my potty mouth. Did I not mention that you're the first human I've sent through that thing? I mean, there've been rodents, but it's not like it's completely untested. There's a lot of small but parts anyway, of the game. Yeah, well, his voice so, is just here. So you should have made it back with everything mm -hmm. you collected out there. That's the beauty of the gateway. It's the only way to get back with all your marbles intact. Right. Now, take those parts you found into the back room. Mm -hmm. I'll let you use my fabrication station. For now. Fabrication station. That station will concoct ways for you to rig up anything from roof racks to flare guns. Uh -huh. Assembling an antenna with those parts you brought back <laughs> should be honky easy. Star rail. But and also got a little rack to to work its from. magic, so bring back as many as you can. And just um, because I haven't used that garage in decades doesn't mean you can trash the place. Mess up my equipment line. and I'll throw you to the anomaly so quick you'll get whiplash. I can't, I don't clear? think it was that. We actually got her full name. I don't think it was off Naomi, but that, that would be pretty fun. Um, hey, Arpy, what you doing, Arpy? Ah, oh, that was amazing. That was awesome. I love the fact that, like, our car got dragged away. Just uh, the the crunch time. That was uh, that was pretty funny. Yeah, so, so that's, um, I think that's a good place to sort of wrap it up there. I, I kind of missed what she was saying before. Um, wrecked car. But hey, it's saved now, so and we can save it, you know, whenever we want. Um, oh, did we only play like an hour 70? Oh, no, it's because I didn't get far enough. I didn't get to this last point because I was dicking around a lot and like just exploring everything. Um, but the game doesn't save until you've finished your, uh, oh, you've finished your run. Ooh. And that's one successful run finished it was very nice of james to let jackie rest in peace this week yeah i did and uh you know obviously this one representing jackie just sleeping uh perfectly normal no weird anomalies going on there uh yeah <laughs> I, can't believe, I still can't believe um the uh sort of snuck that one in um certainly maybe other people were aware of that happening but i certainly wasn't um you willying around i don't believe it Wilsoning around, unbelievable. Um, well, 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 well. Uh, yes, thank you very much for hopping along. I believe we're all rest of the weekend now. Yep, yep. We uh, okay. Let's get the keys. Yep. Right. The weekend is officially. Uh, get that bloody things out. Okay. Time to unlock the weekend. Done. Right. Go on, go on, you bastards! Get at it! No, no, no! Stick around. I'll, uh, we'll, we'll be raiding somebody probably. Um, I just wanted to check. Oh, can I check it on my phone? Because uh, I do believe we have a video going out tonight. Um, but regardless, it's a weirdest games weekend, so do check that out on Sunday. Uh, I think we've got another big video coming out as well. It might be a 101. Um, or maybe that's coming out next weekend. But hey, check out the channel regardless. I know you always are. You're, you're a lovely lot. A lovely lot. You you, you guys, you dudes and duderinos and dudettes and dudooskies. Um, and yeah, thanks a lot for coming on our little, uh, little road trip. That was, that was pretty good. I feel like, despite me waiting for a long time to, to get on the Fallout hype, good amount more of this either way it's a long weekend so we will have all the fun all the fun in the world oh man our uh, it, our, our boy alex has uh he's playing sea of thieves that's an interesting one very interesting okay his sea legs aren't working today james what do you mean happy happy what do you mean oh we're just we're just finishing up unfortunately so yeah um no TP on Monday, it's unlikely, but do keep an eye out because he may well decide, you know, he may well fancy a stream anyway. He may well fancy it. So uh, I believe that that has happened on occasion in the past. So yeah, you just have to check that out. Oh, I'm so sorry, Happy Happy, but don't worry. There's there's always the VODs, uh, you know, on Twitch itself or check out our VODs channel. Uh, same goes for any one of you lovely people. Um, yeah, you can check this out. This should be up on my Monday or Tuesday, I would imagine, uh, for the VODs channel. 
Uh, but yeah, thanks again for popping along. Thank you very much to, uh, who was it? It was Ironwood Studios, I believe. And um, let me double check that. Yeah, thank you very much to Ironwood Studios and for uh, publisher Kepler Interactive for providing our code for the game uh, and letting us stream this in the first place. Very much uh, appreciated. Right. Do a cheeky raid and let's get the hell out of here. We'll do a we'll raid, Alex. We got a we, we representing. Um, this is our lovely uh, and amazing and very talented uh, and very Geordie uh, editor, Alex. <laughs> I mean, he's, he's reasonably Geordie. It's fine. Um, yes, yes, very talented individual. So uh, yeah, do. Do say hello, do pop by, maybe stick around for a little bit. He's playing a bit of Sea of Thieves. And uh, yeah, and you guys, have a lovely time. I'll see you next week for potentially more Cyberpunk. All right, all right? Stay out of trouble. Stay out of trouble. And remember to go vote whenever you can vote. I mean, voting in this country is done now. It's fine, but whatever. Um, right. Bye. See you later. Ooh.